Bamford. There she is. Hey. Um, uh, Hi. Hi. <laughs> Maria Bamford, uh, are you are you at your house? Yes, yes. It's five five thirty a.m. here. Okay. Yeah. Um, is that a what is that a basketball hoop on the wall? That's no, a dream catcher, Tom. Oh, it's a basketball hoop on the wall. <laughs> You know, that's what we do here. Whatever he says, we agree with. Yes, that's what it is, Tom. Yes. I have a deep bench. <laughs> <laughs> right. Are you catching any dreams? Uh, well, that is actually like a mobile. Um, but yes, I, I do. Certainly, I live in California, so I believe in all the manner of manner of things that don't make sense. Right. Uh, Maria Bamford is our guest, a distinguished comedian. And Maria, actually, if I've got this correct, she's going to be at the Dead Crow Comedy Room in Wilmington, yes. North Carolina, coming up this Friday and yes. Saturday. Oh, a beautiful it's spot. True. That'll be yes. lovely. Yes, um, it'll be really fun. We were talking about um, crows, crows yesterday on the show. And um, oh. they're very intelligent birds. I don't know if you knew this. Very smart. <laughs> and... Uh, yo, Why are you bringing this up yeah, now? Yeah, we have a what? guess. Well, because I, 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 maybe she's got a hunk on crows. I don't, know <laughs> <laughs> I don't think. Never mind. That is how my husband lets me know that uh, he's home. Oh, he, via he crows? crows? Uh, yeah, like a, like a, more like a grackle than uh. a crow. <laughs> <laughs> good, good, good. Um, yeah, uh, we were talking about uh, they're training crows to pick up cigarette butts. <laughs> really? Yeah. So, uh, it's kind of a nice thing. But there's people complaining oh. that apparently the crows are getting addicted to the nicotine. Well, I love it. If they're not wrong. Um, it's hard to get smoker. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, what's, what's new in your life these days, Maria? What's going on? Uh, well, uh, let me see. This is super. My my father passed, uh, but don't uh, don't worry about it. He said three months ago before he died, he said, uh, hey, Maria, "I just want to let you know that if I die, I did it." <laughs> um, that's, that's a comfort. Yeah. Um, but uh, uh, yeah, just enjoying um, married life as well as. Uh, Living in Cal California, of course, member of several problematic cults in the L.A. area. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you've heard of 12-step groups. I'm very much into those. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, they're a terrible idea. Peer counseling, notoriously not good. <laughs> um, but I, uh, they're free. Number ah. two, free. Number three, they cannot kick you out. Even oh. if I go to a meeting with a full bottle of Jack Daniels. <laughs> And I'm eating an ice cream cake with a stolen porn DVD. All anybody <laughs> will ever say to me is keep coming back because they're very dumb angels. <laughs> oh, I love now, am um, I correct in saying that uh, your your husband he's a paint a painter, right? Uh, or, or... Yes, he's a painter. He's um uh he, he paints still lives and uh, ScottMarvelCassidy.com. Um, I'm sorry. Give, give also, me, give me the, give me the website again. I'm sorry. I, you said it too quick. That marvelcassidy. That's right. Com. That's right. Um, and uh, yeah, we have a hobby in common. We found out over the quarantine. Uh, something we both started doing around the age of ten on our own. You can teach yourself. Uh, it's uh, that pastime is called longing for death. <laughs> and, uh, uh huh. <laughs> suicidal ideation does eat the clock. And, uh, yeah, don't recommend it. We were both having a bad day. I said, hey, what are you thinking about? He said, what are you thinking about? <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> yeah. Don't worry about us. Don't worry about us. We I'm have looking, some uh, suicide prevention people. We have one of those safety contracts. That I, Maria, will not kill myself. Nothing prevents impulsive self-harm quicker than paperwork. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> it's in a magnetized chip clip on the front of our refrigerator <laughs> so if ever one of you hobos comes over and tries to help yourself to a cran ras la croix, <laughs> <laughs> you know we're okay. okay. <laughs> Maria Bamford is our guest. I'm looking at uh, Scott Marvel Cassidy's paintings online. I'd, I remembered that they were great. They are really fantastic. Yes, he's a great painter. Excellent, excellent. He um, is uh, like photorealistic, but he is painting from life. He is painting uh, with those th objects 
staring at them for hours. Uh, while Does he playing, paint you? Uh, Does he paint you? Uh, he tries. I am. I don't like to sit for too long. <laughs> so, um, well, he should know what you look like by now. Well, <laughs> you know, it's kind of blurry when I'm moving all around. Yeah. Uh, mm. But he he has painted me before, and um, I'm looking good. I got to tell you that much. Mm. All right. Uh, <laughs> um, the one I'm yeah, looking at. There's an ultra realistic upside down Oprah Winfrey magazine is yeah. sort, sort of off <laughs> off in the corner. Oh, but it's it's amazing. It's really really. What does that mean? Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, no, he's an excellent excellent player. We met on OK Cupid. Uh, I cannot uh, advertise enough for OK Cupid if, if that's still a thing. Yeah, did he um, did he know that you were a uh, uh, entertainer, comedian, actress. He did, he did. And uh, he had just, had, a friend had just forwarded my stuff to him, like, you know, several months ago before he met me. And uh, he was like, right on. Um, the thing actually that connected us the most was that uh, his mom was bipolar. I am bipolar. And so uh, he was like, hey, you know, if you ever have to go to the hospital, I'll, co I'll come in and shave your beard. <laughs> and I was like, that's about the most romantic thing I've ever heard you tell. That's not love. I'll kiss your, yeah, yeah before oh, the yeah. first date even. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, he's, the, 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 we were both down to, to work it out no matter what. And, um, yeah, it's been great. I just want to say briefly, uh, 988 is the new suicide hotline. Whenever you mention suicide, you're supposed to mention suicide hotline. Uh, I also say call anybody. Uh, call Hertz Rent a Car. I did. Oh. Uh, oh. Yeah. I I called them. They picked up on the first ring. Um, uh, now, before hanging up on me, she did say, you know, after saying, all I can do is lease you a car. Uh -huh. She did say, you know, sweetheart, I do believe every human life has value. You too care. Um, <laughs> sometimes that's all you need. A little bit of confirmation. That's all you need. That's, that's right. all you need. Yeah. Some, sometimes the suicide hotline has wait time of 45 minutes. Ooh. Yeah, <laughs> that's, geez. Yeah, that's too long. <laughs> you got to call somebody in between. I've dialed the operator. Uh, dialed zero. Got him in a roundabout way to tell me that he loved me. Oh, um, okay. That's right. I said, I said, I got in, in debt to the IRS and uh, sometimes uh, the agent, sometimes IRS will come to your front door, knock, 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 and say, we are now seizing $60,000. And I said, from in here? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can check under the yeah. cushions, but I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> And I, I asked the operator, I said, hey, man, would you still love someone if through their own stupidity and neglect, they got themselves in a crippling amount of de debt? And this young man said, yeah, I guess. The village <laughs> rises up to meet you. Um, That's right. My, my, fa my favorite thing is to call the, the anti-abortion people because all their literature says life is a gift. Have them take the time to prove it to you. Um, <laughs> I, I, yeah, no, I'm not pregnant. My mother was. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and she kept it. So what, 52 years later, what's the plan? Uh, I would like to be placed in a loving home. <laughs> Hey, Maria, I, I noticed, uh, I, I think I can see correctly, uh, uh, only two of your fingernails were painted on your left That's hand. That's right. Are you judging me? Is, <laughs> is, that, the, is that some kind that? of code thing? What does that mean? No, it's just that uh, if you've seen it, uh, fingernail polish comes off yes, at some point. It's it does. Object, it, it's about, yeah, impermanence is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Happens it's to also, all us ladies. Yeah. It's 150 bucks to get gels put on, so um, I got to save up. Oof. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and will you just uh, go there with the two fingers like that to the Dead Crow Comedy <laughs> Room in Wilmington this weekend? Or? Are you going to have your nails done before you, the big show? So you're judging her by your yeah, nail I think polish? You are. I'm just asking. Wow. <laughs> I know. Right? Wow. I know. Yeah. Right? Yeah, um, 
I may, but I may very well not. Now that you've said something about it. <laughs> <Good for you. laughs> Just, I thought it was some California thing. <laughs> Just do the two and the ends. No. Nope. Oh, how dare you? <laughs> how dare you, sir? <laughs> uh, well, uh, Maria, have a couple of great shows. Once again, it's uh, the Dead Crow Comedy Room in Wilmington, North Carolina. And remember, crows are so smart, and so is Maria. Yes, she is. And you will, you will, uh, you'll never see anything quite. Like, oh, by the way, Maria, I was just passed this note. It says your memoir is coming out. Yes. <laughs> is it this the correct title? Sure, I'll, I'll join your cult. That is true. Yes, and I <laughs> will join any, anything for up to two weeks. Jehovah <laughs> Witnesses. All right. Um, I will, anything. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love it. I love to get get into a cult and then pull out fast. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay. Thanks, right. Maria. Thank you so much. Have Thanks. some great shows. Thanks Always so much a for pleasure. Having me. Thanks a lot. Yes. Have a great day. You too. Bye. See you, Maria. Bye.